Hey, what is good, A team? It's your boy T back at it with another reaction. As y'all can see back there, the game is actually still going on. Um, for all the ones who don't know, might be new to the channel. I told y'all we're not reacting to the actual highlights no more this season. Um, bro, first of all, my Saints played the Panthers today, right? I told y'all like a week or two back, I was supposed to be at this game in Charlotte. I stay in VA. Charlotte is the closest to to me as far as the like NFL team, with the exception of uh, Washington or something like that. Supposed to be at the game, had the tickets, hotel was booked, all that. Literally, I think it was like maybe four or five days ago, they canceled all the damn tickets, and they sent a, a little email out that was saying that basically nobody. Um, except for friends and family of the football teams would be able to attend the, the actual game. So their capacity went down from like 5,000 down to like 1,500 or something like that. I'm like, bro, this was like literally my one time to be able to see Drew Brees potentially on his last season. Because if they end up winning it, I feel like he's going to be out. Well, even if they don't win it, I think he's going to retire either way. But I'm not 100% sure on that. I'm like, bro, that's tough, my guy. That is tough. You feel me? I was supposed to be in the building live streaming this game for y'all. But it is what it is, man. Either way, the Saints did get the the uh, dub. We we up right now. So it's like a minute and a half left. But we up right now 33-7. to seven. Drew Brees already got subbed out. Got Jameis Winston in. Um, so this was definitely a pretty good dub for us this week. Only thing is, I, I still can't put too much into it because it's the Panthers. They were four and ten, ended the season four and eleven, basically, or five and ten. Hold on, real quick. What was their record, bro? It was five and ten going into this game. So after this loss, they're five and eleven for the season. We finished the season off twelve and four, so that's actually a pretty good record. Of course, we locked up the, the division last week. But unfortunately, we don't get that first week by because we ended up losing to the Eagles. And, well, really, even if we didn't lose to the to the Eagles, I think we still would have. We still would have been tied with the same record as Green Bay. You feel me? So I don't know if there. I'm pretty sure there still would have been some way we could have ended up with the number one seed um, if we did get that win versus Philly. But it is what it is. You feel me? You can't go back in the past and change it. But either way, bro, it's looking like Green Bay's got that first week by, and they got home field advantage throughout the playoffs. It's been snowing like, I think it snowed last week um, when Green Bay played. I can't remember who they played, though. Maybe it was Detroit. But either way, it definitely snowed there. So hopefully we ain't got to deal with nothing like that if we do end up meeting them in the actual playoffs. But they're saying we're supposed to play next week or this this upcoming weekend, I believe. I'm not sure who we supposed to be playing. If anybody got any info on that, get down there in the comments. Let your boy know. But um, like I said, as far as this game this week, we did pretty good. We still gave up a, a, a handful of third downs, I'd say. You feel me? Because it was a it was a couple play. They like it was third and or third and one, and I think they went for it on a, a couple of fourth downs as well. I'm like, bro, like, I mean, I wasn't too worried about it because I'm like, all right, we still holding it down offensively and overall defensively. We were still doing our thing, but it was like, bro, we can't keep giving up no fourth and ones, like, especially come playoff time, bro. That's going to be critical, you feel me? But we definitely held it down today. Teddy Bridgewater, I think he got hurt. Um, well, he a, a big hit was actually like in the first, either the end of the first or the start of the second quarter. But um, I ended up leaving out, and I didn't get back until I left out at halftime, didn't come back to like midway through the third quarter, and Teddy Bridgewater was already out. So I don't know if he started the third quarter and then just ended up not playing after that. Like, I, I don't know, bro. I don't know if he actually got hurt again or if they just didn't start him for the second half. You feel me? Either way, like I said, the season is over. On to next week, which I believe is the first round of the playoffs. I don't really understand. Or like I know, cause we're not playing in a in a wild card game, are we? Like ain't ain't no way. But I felt like it was always the wild card games first, then the actual first round of the of the playoffs. But they saying we supposed to be playing next weekend, so I don't know. We gonna see how it all shake out um, after all these games are played today. 
But it is what it is, bro. You feel me? Who that nation in the building, baby? You feel I'm, re I'm ready to go crazy. Even though we might have to go through Lambeau Field for it. I don't even care, bro. You feel me? Like, I'm just hyped up for the playoffs. Of course, this week we didn't have Alvin Kamara. Michael Thomas still ain't back. I think he's supposed to be back for the first game of the playoffs. Um, Kamara, they saying if we got to play Saturday, he might not be able to because of the whole COVID list and all that. Um, so that that would definitely be tough if, if, like, we ain't got him there as well. But the, the running backs we brought in today – Excuse me, I can't remember what their name was. Like, number 80-something, I think. He was actually doing pretty good. And it was another guy on defense who they say was a rookie, and it was his first game. Um, I can't remember his name, but he was number 30. I think his last name started with a with a L, if I'm not mistaken. Like, I don't know, bro. I don't know, but he was actually doing pretty good as well. Um, we also were missing, like, I think two other running backs. If I'm not mistaken, but either way, bro, we still held it down, especially for us to not be at 100%. But like I said, I don't want to put too much into it because it's the Panthers. It's not like we did this against a top-ranked team or something being shorthanded. But it still is a good dub for us, you feel me? Good way to go ahead and finish it off. Um, like I said, we y'all stay tuned for the reaction next week. I'm not sure who we're supposed to be playing, but if y'all know, get down there in the comments, let your boy know, you feel me? And let me know how, like, what y'all think about to happen as far as this whole playoff picture, bro. Like, who y'all got for the Super Bowl matchup and all that. I don't, don't want to get too ahead of ourselves, but I want it to be the Saints versus the Chiefs, if I'm being honest. Like, I know Kansas City is Kansas City, but I, I would love to see them in the playoffs. And if we could go through Green Bay and Lambeau Field, beat them, and then beat Kansas City in the actual uh, Super Bowl, that would be a tough way for for Drew Brees to end it off. You feel me? Like, y'all played the toughest teams, one in, yo, one in the NFC en route to the Super Bowl, and then the toughest team in the Super Bowl and beat both of them. I would be, hey, you couldn't, tell, you couldn't tell me nothing until next season, man. What you mean? But either way, bro, I really ain't got too much else to say. We done basically wrapped it up. Um... But, hey, I need y'all to get down there in the comments. Let me know what y'all thought about this game. Again, let me know what y'all think is going to shake out as far as the actual playoffs and all that. Um, if y'all got suggestions for new reactions, be sure to drop those down below as well. And, hey, man, we on the road to 15K subscribers, 18. I appreciate all the love y'all been showing so far. Let's keep it going, keep it growing. And like always, say y'all keep coming back, tuning in. I'm going to keep these videos rolling out. We're going to keep getting it lit over here. Catch y'all in the next video.